Hello, this is Professor James Daniel. I was asked by my ex-student, former student, Mr. Mike Plummer, to discuss pharaohs and whether pharaohs really work or not. Well, I'm a professor of about 35 years. I've taught at several institutions, but I have never conducted my own independent scientific studies of pharaohs. But from reading periodicals and journals, and, and, and not just looking for research on the blogosphere of people who have not been in the lab since high school, I concluded that pharaohs do work. And again, my conclusion is based upon real scientific studies and research, not the blogosphere. Let's talk about pharaohs for a minute. What is undisputed about pharaohs? Pharaohs do exist. No one can dispute that. Pharaohs play a role in sexual attractions in animals and mammals. No one can debate that. It's undisputed that pharaohs have been identified and isolated in humans. Nobody can present a study otherwise. But what is up for debate by some is whether humans have evolved to the point where we cannot recognize and identify pharaohs anymore. Well, the truth is, there's been studies on this, and nothing I could be able to find that show that this is, is true. All of the studies I've found quite show quite the contrary. There was a study done at Stanford that showed that pharaohs do work. There was one study performed by a Harvard professor, which basically did a test of young women who used synthetic pharaohs. And at the end of the study, it was found that those women who actually had pharaohs compared to the women who had uh, placebos actually had more sexual attention and actual more sexual uh, intercourse than the women who did not. ABC 2020, a very reputable in, uh, news network, did their own study. It wasn't a scientific study. It was more of a test or social study. When they took two sets of twins, male twins and female twins, each one of the twins had uh, one, one twin for each set had a pharaoh, and the other one did not. They went on a dating, speed dating of sorts, and the ones that wore the, the two, the two uh, twins that wore the pharaohs had more people interested in them than the ones not. There's study after study that suggests that pharaohs do work. And I am convinced that they work too. After reading all of these journals and these periodicals, I bought me a little small bottle of pharaohs myself. And I can tell you they do work because it got quite interesting in the professor's lounge, if you know what I mean. But seriously, the, the pharaohs do work. Uh, no studies have suggested that pharaohs don't work. I have not been able to find anything that's credible that so show otherwise. So I'd like to tell Mr. Mike Plummer that I could go to this study for you, and, and I am convinced as a professor of 35 years that they do it. Finally, I will come back, and I was asked by Mr. Plummer to, to explain how pharaohs work. I'm not going to do it in this video, but you could go to pharaohs360.com and read all about pharaohs and the pharaohs reviews that have been done by Mr. Plummer and his friends and his colleagues and his comrades. It must be a fun job to review and report on pharaohs, but you do what you do. But again, please check back and look for my future videos. Thank you.